Leo, 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 what's going on? What's going on? I, I can't even I can't even get to the intro and, and give everybody the breakdown like I want to because it's, it's reading so it's reading got me so down, man. Like what, what what's going on, Leo? What's going on? I uh hold on, let me let, let me let me go ahead and get this out of the way first. Guys, if y'all if you want to book your personals, you want to book your personals, please uh, hit the description box. Or you guys can go straight to the website at grandvisorllc.com and book your personals. And well, um, if the if the role doesn't fit for you, please do not make the role fit for your life. If it does not fit, please do not make it fit. Last but not least, guys, hit the um, can you please hit the subscribe bell, hit the notification so you guys can see when the videos are being uploaded. All right. No, Leo, let's get back to you. What's going on? Somebody, first cause you got a three of pentacles in, in reverse. Somebody, somebody's in the heavy place. Somebody's in a very heavy place. I'm feeling like a heavy dark place. It's not, it's, it's not a good energy. I don't feel a good energy coming from this. It's like you in your head. You're not feeling yourself. You're not feeling like yourself. You're feeling down. You're feeling miserable. Your environment probably feeling toxic. Nothing about you is like it's, it's like everything about you right now is not glowing. Nothing is glowing about you right now. What's going on? Somebody please drop drop some comments. Let me know what's going on, Leo. The next card you got out is the Wheel of Fortune. The Wheel of Fortune usually brings change, brings shift. So what happened? Did, did something happen? Something happened that put you in this place? A major change. Or maybe you want in a major change because you because you feel like nothing has been happening. Because you've been stuck in this place, nothing in, you feel like nothing around your life is moving the way you want. What is it? Are you trying to keep it? Are you trying to keep people around you happy? Are you in your own head? Are you are are, are you locked into your own insecurities, your own doubt? What's going on? Especially for this place to be so, for, for this energy to be so heavy, Leo. The next card you got is the Knight of Pentacles. What, what? In reverse. Be, feeling, feeling stagnant, feeling at a hope. Some of you guys could be having money problems, which could potentially explain why you also in this Three of Pentacles in reverse. Some of you could be having money problems. Your money not leaking the way it, it was before. With COVID, it's been, it's, been, been, it's been heavy for a lot of people trying to get their lives back together, trying to recoup from this situation. You feel me? A lot of you could be having money problems. A lot of you could be just stagnant in your cells. You're not feeling, you're not feeling grounded in your cells. You're not feeling stable in your own mind. You're battling your own thoughts. You're battling your own heart, your own everything. Has you in it? Has you in this place of of wanting to do more and be more, but you can't. Could possibly be holding yourself here. Could be possibly holding yourself back from this change. Is it? Is it? Is it the stubborn Leo nature? Come on now, talk to me. Cause we all know Leos can be very, very stubborn when they when, when they want it their way. They just want it their way. Is it because you in this stu stubborn place, huh? Next card you got out is the lovers in reverse. Oh, uh, you're not loving yourself. You're not loving yourself. Maybe you want love. Maybe you missing love. Maybe you're in this place because you feeling like nobody loves you. Maybe you're in this place because you feeling like nobody loves you. Well, guess what? I love you, Leo. I don't care what nobody say or, or what nobody else got going on. You, if you, if, if you a king out there, my brother, I love you. If you queen out there, my queen, I love you. Get out of this place. Get. Lift your crown up. Everything gonna be okay. If you hoping to manifesting for love, it's it, it it will come. But you have to get out of this place. You have to get into the place of manifesting this for you. Because it, as long as you stuck in this place of not loving yourself, you can't tap into you can't tap into your spiritual and, and allow it to make the universe to move for you. You have to want it for yourself first. And I get it, your environment is the change, but the change starts in you, meaning you have to adjust things around you. Because the truth of the matter is you have, you, you got a lot of toxicity, you, you have a lot of toxic things around you. It's a lot of toxicity around you. And you know it, 
is bringing you down. It got your spirit crumbling. It could be a person. It could be somebody that you, it could be a love that you probably want to move towards, but you haven't, which could also have you in this place. Could also have you in this place and it's stuck in your own head, in your own mind, in your own thought, not feeling yourself, not loving yourself. Could have been something that something that happened. Whatever the situation is, I'm feeling like you because your environment could be playing a part in why you haven't moved here. If this is loving yourself, the environment could be playing a part why you haven't moved there. You feel me? If the, if this is you wanting to move towards a, a more grounded situation with somebody, your environment, huh? Because truth be told, you got the ten of pentacles right here. This is a this is almost like a and this is also why I say I feel like it could be a person. The ten of pentacles usually can bring husband wife energy. Can you can usually bring a husband and wife energy? You could be wanting to move towards somebody. You could see somebody in your view as a husband and wife, but you can't move towards them because of your life. Maybe it's your life that has you stagnant in that, in that a hope. Uh oh, hold on. But you want the change though. The change right there for you. I'm feeling. You want me to be honest with you? I'm feeling like the only thing holding you right here is because you haven't moved or made your own mind up. It's almost like you you got your own self shackled. It's almost like you shackling yourself to this. Yeah, yeah. That's exactly what the devil card is when you're feeling tied and bound to something. When you're feeling tied or bound to something, you could be married to this person. You could have kids by this person. You're feeling like you can't get away. Uh-uh. How? How can't you get away? Everything is in your control. Spirit letting you know right now that you have the control of whatever is, is meant to go on in your life. That you can control it. If you really want this 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 wife or this husband, this this happy life, this overflow of abundance, you see the pinnacles falling out the chest. They're not just sitting in, they falling out. So this is overflow. This is overflow. You getting back to this place right here is where you need to be, Leo. Because that's the only way that you're going to be able to turn this into this. Because I feel like this person is already, I feel like this person is around, could possibly be be around you or you may have already bumped into them so you know who this person is if this if for my leos if this is yourself that you battling that, that that you're trying to get back to the to this person you already know what you have to do you know the ties you have to cut the connections you have to, to cut the cords you have to cut And it's, it, it, it makes me happy to see this to see this judgment card as your final card because that's telling me that way. That's telling me that Leo, you are making a decision for you. No more moving for it for everybody else. No more moving for the for the for the for the for the for the, the false love connection. No more moving for the family members for the for the friends. No more of that. No more trying to. No more. No more being being. Not moving from your own ego. Oh. Hold on. Let me say that again. Not. No more of not moving because of your own ego. Your own pride. Putting it to the side now. Because you know that in order to get to this right here. In order for you to embrace this. And I'm almost feeling like this person. Obviously this is somebody that. It, for my Leos out here that where 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 the love is the manifestation, I'm almost feeling like whoever this person is, you didn't expect them to be them. Whoever this person is, you didn't expect it to be them. Because this person got you all out of whack. <laughs> this person got you all out of whack. So obviously you didn't expect it to be them, but because it is them and it blew your mind, you, you see the Ten of Pentacles with them. You see the building. You see the foundation. And that's what's causing you to push you into this place right here. That that is exactly what's causing you to push you into this place because you don't want to lose them. You don't find you. I think you don't finally found something that, that worth fighting for. There we go. Whether whether this is a person or your own insanity, baby, it don't even matter. Whether this is your own insanity, your own peace, whatever this is, it is worth you fighting for. So much that you're willing to move. You ready? You ready to step? You feel me? And you can do it. You got this. Don't let nobody around you tell you what you can and you can't do. Can't, don't let nobody around you dictate your happiness. At the end of the day, it's about you. Don't let you be your own hinder. All right?
Let's go, Leo.